you just had a birthday. When was your birthday? Do you want me to tell the truth or you want me to lie? My uh, birthday was October, <laughs> October 21st. I was 76. Wow. <laughs> now, <laughs> what, what do you think, that, what, what do you attribute that you have so much energy at that age? You have two choices as you get older. Mm -hmm. Did you, I mean, did you ever think that you would be 60? No, I, 60 to me 60, feels like six, I can't believe it. You know, 60, my grandmother had breasts that started her neck and they stopped <laughs> at her knees. Right, right. I, I remember that, that was the look. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> I think that, you know who told me that an age is just a number for the first time? Florence Henderson. I remember having dinner with Flo when she turned 70. And we had dinner, and she had a couple of cocktails, which she was prone to do, mm -hmm. and then got into her car to drive home. I said, Flo, you sure you don't want to get into a cab? And, oh, no, I'm fine. I said, you know, 70 is 70. She said, Judy, 70 is the new 50, and it's just a number. And I remember that. Yeah. And the people that I know who are older and spirited look like they were having a good time. Mm -hmm. And the people who are older and don't do anything to keep themselves younger don't look like they're getting the best bang for their buck out of life. Yeah, So yeah. that's it, that's well, the story. It, and you love what you do. I mean, that helps. But, yeah, I, I feel like it really is just a number. I, I you know, I think that it's, it's really about uh, your, the way you think and the way you act is, you know, more important than, than anything because, you know, I, I feel I'm extremely immature. I mean, I, I, I play games, I scare people all the time. I do things that a 60-year-old shouldn't do, but I just still, I feel like I'm, I'm young. I feel that. I feel young, except when I look in a full-length mirror. Yeah, well, make sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then, yeah. Then, then I have, then it all comes back because, yeah. you know, I mean, we don't know. We're mostly girls here, right? You know that you can keep yourself fit and in shape. And I do, and I know that you do. They haven't invented anything yet that keeps your skin in shape. So there are certain things that can't, that don't lie. Now, yeah. I'm almost at full sleeve because it was a time when I covered from here to here. Uh -huh. And then it started to creep down over here. <laughs> And soon I'm going to be wearing gloves. A lot of people wear gloves. There are people, people that wear gloves. wear gloves. But yeah, so let's talk about the skin care Let's talk thing. about be skin. That was a good segue. It is a good segue because they've done the same thing to me. And uh, we're trying to find them because they need to stop. So tell, tell everyone what happened to you because they make up stuff. Well, this is a slippery, sleazy, scammy outfit who allegedly makes a skincare product and they take celebrities they take celebrities who, some of whom are senior. When I say senior, anything plus 40 mm -hmm. that look terrific. And the older you are and the better you look, the more of a good spokesperson, I guess, they think you are for right. this line. And they use your name and likeness and image and say you have invented and endorsed this wonderful cream. Send us your credit card and we'll send you free samples, we'll just charge you for this. And it's a scam. And they scam thousands of dollars from people once they have your credit card. But you know, the internet could be a very powerful, useful, wonderful, positive tool. But then there are people who are always bad people. Yeah. And they will find an evil use for the internet. Yeah. And they are somewhere embedded in clouds. But I have to tell you, I'm on the case. Yeah, we are too. We're on the case, too. We're going to find them. A lot of different places yeah. on the case. But they're slippery. They, they, it's hard to find them, but we're going to find them. But I mean, the thing is, if you don't see someone, if you don't see us with our mouths moving talking about a product, if you just see a picture of us, we're not endorsing that product. And if you just think, if these people spent one half the time learning to do something legitimate, rather than something that was illegal and a scam, they probably could invent cures to every major disease. But, but yeah. stupid. Yeah. Stupid. Hi, I'm Andy. Ellen asked me to remind you to subscribe to her channel so you can see more awesome videos, like videos of me getting scared or saying embarrassing things, like ball peen hammer, and also some videos of Ellen and other celebrities, if you're into that sort of thing. Oh,
Come on.